You are definitely waking up to a rough commute to work. That's right. Of course, the snow that fell yesterday and overnight has already caused some messy roads out there, especially out east. KKTV 11 News reporter Stephanie Ross is live on Highway 24 this morning. Steph, how are conditions out in that neck of the woods? You know what? It's pretty bad out here. Pretty icy on Highway 24. A lot of snow that actually fell out here, probably about three or four inches on the ground right now. And it's definitely causing some problems as far as, as the roads are concerned. If you want to take a look behind me, this is Highway 24. Kind of hard to see because it is so dark right now, but it, there is a layer of ice on these roads. We were having some problems while we were coming out here as well. Just really icy, icy conditions and the snow is continuing to fall just a little bit. We do have some flurries out here, so and it is chilly as well. So anything that really is falling is not going to be melting. It's going to be icy, icy roads and really any of those side streets, any of the, the the neighborhoods that you, that you had to drive through. I had to drive through this morning. Very, very rough to go through as well. I-25, not too bad. It's actually more wet than anything. They've had time to treat that, but really anywhere else, not really in good shape this morning as you're driving to work. So just really be careful. Give yourself some extra time because there are some definite icy, icy spots out there this morning. Johnny Kim? All right, take it slow. Thanks, Steph. Mm -hmm. Oh, and abso absolutely. And we are on accident alert as well in Colorado Springs. So if you do get in an accident, just exchange information as well. All right, Stephanie Ross Live, thanks. Mm -hmm. The 11 News reporter Stephanie Ross live on Highway 24 this morning. And I know last time we checked in with you, you said it was pretty icy out there. It is very icy out here, really icy all over Colorado Springs as well. Um, definitely when I was coming into work this morning, dealing with a lot of icy roads and neighborhoods, side streets, those were are really going to where you're, where you're going to have the largest problems, but really just a mess out there all over the place this morning. So you really want to be careful, give yourself some extra time, but you can take a look at Highway 24 behind me. It's still really slow right now as far as we're not really, you know, into much rush hour, not a whole lot of people driving on the road too bad right now, but um, people are having to slow down here. It is there is a nice fine layer of ice and so people are, are really trying to take some caution, which is a good idea. People are going to have to slow down this morning. A little bit, a little bit more snow out east than we did maybe get in the center of Colorado Springs. Not snowing at all right now, but as Brandon was saying, it's going to kind of be hit and miss throughout the morning, possibly getting later, better later in the in the day. So maybe your afternoon drive might be a little bit better than your morning drive. But this morning, you are definitely going to have to just take some time and and be careful. Uh, we are on accident alert in Colorado Springs, so if you do get in an accident, just exchange information and call police within 48 hours. John Kim. All right, thanks, Stephanie. Mm -hmm. Well, other weather problems in Georgia, the state is beginning to